were for the quiz. Um, I have already, you know, the quiz before, but the first question, like this one, uh, one register, the R sub one and C sub one. This is the C sub two. Okay. This is the C sub three. And this is the C sub four. Okay. So five K ohm, but 10 microfaraday and 2.2 microfaraday and this is the 12 volt yeah, okay this is a three one microfaraday this is a four four point seven microfaraday all right the question one what is the total capacitor so from here it's right there first and then it's the step two second look maybe i will give you the later okay yeah now i'm going to recall in the lecture right now so just give me a second so C sub T is, do you remember or in parallel? Right, this one. C sub two, C sub three, C sub four, here. Um, that was the parallel, right? Here. C sub two plus, C sub three plus, C sub four. Stuart, right? Stuart. Uh, Steve, right? It's good, right? Yeah. yeah, right. And then C sub one. Is serious, right? C sub one and um, C sub A. That is what C sub one and C sub A is C sub one plus C sub A, C sub one multiply C sub A. Okay, so I'm gonna skip the calculations, but that was 4.41 microfaraday. Okay, um, any questions? So, the one more time. When you find an exam, you can write only 4.41 microfaraday. Everything? No, okay? No. Usually, in my style, for the instructor, my style, wrong answer. You show me the an equation like this one, I will give you the more the full credit, okay? Just maybe only the answer, nothing. I cannot help it. You understand, okay? Um, any question? All right. So the question two uh, from this circuit, what is for uh, the tau? This is the one time, one time constant. For the RC circuit, the RC circuit that was for the tau, R the total time, C the total. So smart students, smart students, show me equations, wrong answer. C sub T, wrong answer. The right answer, wrong answer. But if you show me that one, maybe I'm gonna give you the maybe eight over 10. Why? For example, what can everyone see now the, um, the equation, the equation, he has only, maybe only minor mistake the calculations. What, eight over 10, eight, eight over 10. But wrong answer, nothing. The two over 10, zero or two over 10, you understand? So the R sub T, the go back to the circuit, we have the only one circuit. This is the 5K multiply is what? Uh, C sub T, right there. 4.41 microfaraday. So the kilo, kilo, micro, 10 to 3, 10 to minus 6, 10 to minus 6, okay? Oh, I'm sorry. This is a 10 to minus 3. It's what? Milli. So don't don't be mistaken, okay? So three is what? Uh, what is the uh, the time to reach out steady state? Steady state, okay? So um, five times the tau, right? Five times what? Uh, I'm gonna have to skip the calculation. That is the answer for 22.05 millisec. Don't missing the unit, okay? Five times 22.05 millisec means 110.25 millisec. Oops, I'm sorry, millisec. So usually the time is unit for milli, I mean the, the, the second, okay? Um, any question? Okay. So here, the next one is for 
the R sub one and inductor and um, inductor was the inductor and inductor. Okay, this is L sub one, L sub two, L sub three, maybe L sub four. That was 100 ohm, the 10 milli hemi. Okay, that was the 22 milli um, hemi. This is was 3.3 milli hemi. Um, that was 5 milli hemi. The E supply voltage, the 10 voltage. Okay. All right. Now, uh, steady state, steady state, the inductor will go to short circuit. However, the capacitor is what? The open circuit. Very good, John. You got an A. Okay. Okay. God bless. All right. So, so Dylan, it's a love, right? But you know, sleepy. Maybe almost do this right now. Hey, Tom. Um. So, um, what is the total the inductor? What is the total inductor? So, step one. Here. L sub A is what? L sub 3 plus the L sub 4, L sub 2, L sub 1. And then here, this is the pedal, right? So the L sub 1 plus L sub 2 pedal, the L sub A. Okay. That is the um, answer. I'm going to just skip calculation, okay? We don't have time too much. I expected today for lecture, you know, just a review for the one hours, okay? Uh, and, the, and then after the end of the lecture, if you have any questions, stop by my office, the personally, the one by one, you know, maybe ask me as well. Mm -hmm. So that is the answer. So I'm going to, the writing the answer is for 16, the, the point two six milli the handy, okay? No only answer, and please don't missing the unit. Okay, all right. Um, any question? Okay. The question two. What is the one time constants? What is the one time constants? In the, here, we learned before. You know. So what is it? The L over R, or R, maybe R over L. L over. L over R, thank you. LT, not, okay. The LT over the RT means the total inductor divided the total register. So right now here, the total inductor from the question one, we have approximately 60 milli Henley. And then the total register go back to the circuit, go back to the circuit. Right there, okay, here. 100 ohm here, okay? So a lot of students has the mistake here. 16, 10 to minus three, 100. So what does that mean? 16 over 10 to three times 10 to two, right? Right? And then 160, 10, three times 10, two times 10. Why? You know, in here, this is a mess. Oops, I'm sorry, right there. The multiply 10, multiply 10 here, okay? So the 10 to 6 over 160 is what? 160 times 10 to minus 6. Make sense? A lot of students has mistake. Take a picture, whatever. So uh, maybe I'm going to record video and I'm loading the YouTube. But So um, this is really minor, the unit mistake. Uh, I can really the slightly minor the reduction, just the minus 0 0.3, minus 0 0.5, but it's really not good for you for the future as your engineer, technician, your advanced for Toyota and your company. It's really the small value, your system, booms, you know, wrong, you know what I mean? So engineer, technician, is very important, the unit, okay? One more time, okay? Um, any question? All right, the last question is, what is the time for the, the same thing? Find the time to reach steady state what does that mean that was five times the tau five times what is the, where's the tau 600 uh, 160 the time 10 to minus 6 10 to minus 6. you don't need it to exactly same but you know maybe 807 805 700 
96, 97, okay, makes sense. But you want to write 1,080 or 10, no, okay? So similar answer is fine. Um, any questions? Okay. Um, okay, Luke is fine. The, the Rogan, the Christian Hill is fine. The, the Preston is fine. The Bush, the Fell is fine. Okay, but Thomas, Matisse, okay. So why do I have to write in here? Why do I have to invest my time to the review for the quiz here? Very important. What does that mean? Very important. Just right now, the one week ago. Not exactly, you know, I, you know, but it's really, really important kind of this one, okay? I'm very busy because to review the chapter nine, I'm very busy, but I invest this time. It's very important, okay? All right. The last questions. The last questions. So that is a lot of students has me say or, but you know, that was really similar questions for in the last session, okay? So right there. The inductor, this is the register here. This is maybe R sub two, um, L sub two. Oops, I'm sorry, I'm gonna, okay, right there. And then this is the R sub one, and C sub one, and R sub one, and E. This is the 15 ball, the 10 milli Henley, 500 ohm here, C sub one, 10 microfaraday, okay? And L sub two, 47 milli Henley, and R sub two, two kilo ohm, okay? All right, the question one, it's a really similar question in the left session, we have already done. What is the V sub C sub one? Means what is voltage drop up the, across the capacitor? So means, so we, we assume that uh, from the questions, we assume that the circuit is operating on steady state, steady state, you know, steady state. So now, now, steady state, what does that mean? The L, short circuit, short circuit, short circuit, and capacitor is what? The open circuit. So, oh, oh, I'm sorry. Uh, yeah. You want A, I'm sorry. You want A, God bless, okay? <laughs> so, right now, this is the current. The open circuit, no. Here, will you follow with me? The push, it's fine. Okay. So, redrawing here. Redrawing. Oops, I'm sorry. This is um. R sub two, R sub one, E, V sub two sub one. Okay. So we learned before in the last session, V sub C sub one, sometimes five tau. Okay. That is the maximum value, right? Uh, maybe after steady state. So that was right there. So what is that? So E is V sub C sub one is V sub R sub two. Okay. E is equal to V sub C sub one is equal to V sub R sub two. Um, any question? Okay. All right. Christian Hill, it's fine. All right. Still have questions, practice yourself, uh, still have questions, but let me know. Okay. All right. I'm very happy to help you. So the V sub C sub one in here, the answer is E. E is 15 volt. Okay. And then the question two, what is the V sub R sub one? Is zero. Why? Because V sub R sub one, the ohm's low, the I times, I'm sorry, I times the R sub one. So what is the I, what Dylan? So what's the what's the I for the V sub R sub one? Zero, right? Yeah. Yeah. So zero, the time the R sub one is what zero. So V sub R sub one is zero. Okay. Very important. Okay. Okay. The last question is what is for what is for the current? The I sub R sub two means it's right there here. The the I sub the R sub two. Yes, sir. Seven point five what milli milli here. It's right there milli. Okay, why one over K means one over one thousand. That was one milli ten two minus three. All right. That is what it had. Okay, the boost, you understand. Chase it, it's fine, okay. All right, so 
This is a quiz, very important. So if you still have questions at the end of the lecture, just come over here. I'm going to help you, okay? All right. So I'm going to, okay, the Mason here. And look, um, could you, look, could you have a sign for me? Just, uh, Did you see the Yeah, circuit. Like, could I draw this? Yes. Not have any value? Oh, no, it's fine. No, it's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Values, no, but you know, but okay. the, the circuit is good. Okay. okay. Oh, thank you, Louis. Sure. All right. Okay, so I'm going to really quickly go over the, from chapter one and chapter A, but just only 30 minutes. Okay, just only 30 minutes. I'm not sure we can cover all of them. So we have the 20 minutes left. Uh, let's see. Okay, here we go. All right, I'm going to really quickly go over, okay, the review for. Review, oops, okay, review for chapter one. Here we go. All right, the chapter one is really uh, simple things. Oops, that is, uh, sorry. Uh, so um, chapter one, that was for really the unit issue, okay? Uh, one kilo, the 10 to three, one milli, 10 to minus three, one mega, 10 to six, one micro, 10 to minus 6, okay? At least you have to know, okay? Um, and um, we have already, okay, chapter 1 and chapter 2. We're going to learn before the ohm law, okay? E is I, the R. This is ohm, this is M, this is volt, okay? All right? And then we learn about the three three main components for the Ohm's law. One is the voltage. The voltage means is potential between two points, okay? All right, so V is what? The, the W over Q. The W is Joule, oops, I'm sorry, Joules, and Q is what? Uh, the columns, the unit. Q is my charge, the symbol is Q, and columns, the unit. Okay, very important. Um, we have a lot of you know the simple questions about the V. Okay, so you can you can try yourself uh, in the in the lecture, and then the um, the um, the current is M symbol the I. Okay, so the current is flow of electron charge. Okay, all right. So that is formula is I Q um, over T, okay? Q is charge, the, uh, sometimes the electrical charge, it depends, but the unit, same thing, C, the columns, right? And T, the time, unit, second, okay? It's very important, okay? Usually we're gonna call this the voltage, the symbol V, but the, in the circuit here, this is the, the battery, we got the E. E, usually the supply voltage, V is just the voltage drop here, okay? Don't confuse it, okay? So this is battery issue. This is a plus, minus. John, you got it. Why do I ask again? It's only one reason, okay? I definitely tuned that part out. Okay, right there. Do you remember like this one here? 10 volt, 5 volt, 3 volt. What is the total voltage? Minus plus plus minus plus minus. Step up. Minus plus 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 minus minus plus minus minus. The two voltage. Okay. The check up. Okay. Yeah, two voltage. Don't confusing and maybe I'm um, embarrassing uh, when your circuit. Okay. Plus minus. The clockwise the current from minus to plus maybe increase. The plus minus what? The decrease minus. The plus minus. The decrease, what? Minus. And all register should be voltage drop, definitely. Plus, minus. There you go, okay? All right. And um, and then we learn about the conductor, okay? We're going to learn about conductor and insulator and um, semiconductor. Um, at least you have to know the concept, okay? What is the conductor? What is the insulator? What is the semiconductor? Especially semiconductor, they have the silicon and... Gallium and gallium arsenium, just like GAAS. That is the main uh, the component for the semiconductor. It means the, the outside shell is for the um, electrons. Okay, so that is what you have to do. 
all right so and then maybe also we learned before like this one do you remember that is the first exam plus minus okay this is what wrong yeah this is the um the ammeter the ammeter is for to measure the current should be connect in series serious okay serious serious and that should be plus that should be minus plus minus plus minus plus minus okay and uh the how about this one the voltage meter or in parallel okay like this one plus minus or this is the voltmeter you have to know the um the connection in series or in, in this parallel okay all right all right and then go to the chapter three we have a we have a resistance it's very important okay the resistance the unit is the ohm um this is the symbol okay this is the symbol uh the resistance is four factor main four factors to affect the characteristics of r so the first one is material material and second thing is length okay third one is cross section or the area and four things is the temperature okay the temperature so that is four factor for register uh, that was the formula is the low length over cross sectional mid area very important okay two star so go to your you know the lecture and your second exam or first exam they have a lot of the simple questions you have to practice from the table i will give you the table if that need okay but do you remember we have a lot of the practice one and especially you know the circular mills for the maybe area circular mills the concept you, you, well you know the mill oops the mill sorry okay, 10 minutes the mill is a unit of measurement for length okay the mill is the unit of the length so one mill is one over 1000 inch and 1000 mils is one inch so it depends on the questions you can transfer from mil to inch to the inch to the mils to find the sometimes i gave you clue length oops, i'm sorry length the cross section of the area circular mils and row you have to find r sometimes you have to find the l from the given clue a row r you know what i mean so it depends on clue you have to do so so cross section of the area we learned before that was the the decimal mills square okay that was the formula okay so um i'm going to skip the, the practice calculations okay you try yourself and if you have any questions please let me know and then maybe also we learned before the register code okay that is very important register the code so for example um here you know what i mean one two three four now but that was you know what i mean red the brown you know the orange is the gold that was we're gonna read from the table to for example the brown one and orange three and gold five percent so from the here yeah the two one it's right here the two one multiply the ten to three and plus or minus what the gold the five percent so uh you have to recognize the color from the table and make a you know the value for register okay everything everything yeah but table uh any the format table whatever don't worry about that okay all right all right so the chapter four okay we learn about the ohms law what time is it okay so 10 52. maybe i will finish maybe 11 okay uh the one hour the um earlier so the ohms law e i r e is equal to i times r okay the ohms law um there's a flaw here plus minus what the current is plus to the minus but however minus the plus the current from the plus minus here the direction of the current is very important okay 
And then the power is what? The symbol is P. The P is I, V, the or I, square R, and over E, square the over R. Okay. Hey, professor, can I use like this one? Yes, it's fine. It doesn't matter. Same thing. Okay. So um, one horsepower, usually we got a motor, you know, that was 7046 watts. Okay. It's right there. So the active power, okay, for the A circuit, we got a lot more detail, but the, the power, P is equal to VI, sometimes I square R, E square over R. Hey, professor, why do we have to know the three equations? Sometimes from the questions, I can only give you a clue I and R and find the P. You can use resistance equation. Or sometimes you can find one clue for I and V to find P. You can use the depth equation, okay? It depends on the equations, you can find the P. The unit is what? Or sometimes uh, 24, 24 horsepower. What is the maybe uh, the power, the active power? For 24, the multiply 746 watt, well, that is the answer, something like this. It's very important. All right, so that is what we have to do. And then also uh, in the chapter four, we're gonna learn about the KVL. That was very important. Kiri post, the voltage, low. Okay, KVL. So what is that? This is the uh, D, D algebraic sum of the potential rise means plus oh, i'm sorry minus two oops, minus two plus and drops means plus to the minus around a closed loop or pass is zero zero this is very important for example in the circuit here this is r sub one this is r sub two this is r sub three one two three is what it is we sub r sub one plus we sub r sub two plus we sub r sub three plus minus plus minus plus minus the current like this one this may be i okay this is we sub r sub one we sub r sub two we sub r sub three we're gonna call this the voltage drop okay this is very important this is the kbl okay so in here um oops in here we're gonna be writing i sub t times the r sub one plus i sub t times the r sub two plus i sub t times r sub three this is we sub r sub one. This is we sub r sub two. This is we sub r sub three. Okay. And then the total register is what the r sub one plus r sub two plus the r sub three. All right. So this is the last the chapter for today. The parallel circuit. So chapter six is parallel circuit. All right. The parallel circuit is same thing. Write this one. One. Two here E R sub one and R sub two here E is we sub R sub one plus we sub R sub two here okay why no elements the between two the uh, E and R sub one no elements okay R sub one and R sub two between them so that is what we have to do and the total register is R sub one parallel the R sub two is what R sub one plus R sub two, R sub one times R sub two, or the, the um, or one over R sub one plus R sub two, okay? And then in here, the current divider rule, very important. A lot of students has mistake here. A current divider rule here. The, the I sub T is I sub R sub one and I sub R sub two, I sub R sub two, I sub R sub two, I sub R sub one, junction. What does that mean, junction, professor? Two more, two or two more, the line combined, the junction right there, two point. So that is what the I sub T. So the I sub T is I sub R sub one here, and the I sub R sub two, okay? That is for the parallel circuit, what I wanted to do. Maybe how about the three line, something like this. That was for here, one over R sub one, one over R sub two, one over R sub three, very important. Okay, very important. Only one reason, very important. 